The start of the school year means that there will be more students on campus. And with two confirmed cases of H1N1 this past month, the UW is preparing its students for a possible outbreak. Since the UW is the last university in the nation to begin classes this year, UW officials have been able to observe what's been happening on other campuses around the country. We expect that when everybody comes back next week that at some point we'll have a little dust up. UW's Environmental Health and Safety Department is putting together 10,000 flu kits to give to students in residence halls and the Greek community. What we're focusing on are those students who are living on campus who don't really have access to a car so they can go and get things like, you know, thermometers and sanitizing solution. In mid to late October, students can get free H1N1 vaccines at vaccination stations throughout campus. Doses will arrive in waves and will first be distributed in the densely populated residence halls and the Greek community. So we're trying to get uh, proactive. We are encouraging everyone to get seasonal flu shots here on campus. You can get them or call help. Um, and then when the vaccine comes for H1N1, to make it available for those who are most at risk. So now to reduce your risk of getting H1N1, officials say to wash your hands frequently and to just stay home if you're feeling under the weather. Reporting for the Daily Webcast, I'm Caitlin Chow.